Dr. Bear. Hello. What are you doing? I'm just sitting here. Yeah. Well, we thought we'd make this video to show you guys what six thousand five hundred dollars could buy. How's that? Yeah. Let's show. That's them. True. Let's show. Them. Hold that up in your hand. Ta-da! <laughs> Hold it by the key. I'm, I don't know if I'm getting a good shot of this or not. By the key, honey. Can you guys see what that is? I don't know if this camera's picking it up. See that? What is that, Pooh Bear? It's the key to Buick. And that's what we gave $6,500 for? It sure is. <laughs> and why is that, Pooh Bear? Because my Buick caught on fire. It did? Yes, it did. Oh, well. So what are you going to do tomorrow? Tomorrow I'm going to go get me a new car. And what are you getting? A Chevy. What kind? An HHR. Yeah. Do you want to tell them what HHR means? Uh. <laughs> or do you want me to tell them? I can't remember what you said. It's something. It's. Do you want me to tell them? Yeah, you can tell them. Well, when we first looked at it, driving through the lot of the dealership, I said, "Look, hun, there's an HHR." And she's like. Oh, that's cool. She jumps out and wants to go look at it. And I said, holy hell, Rhonda. <laughs> well, that's what the HHR stands for in my book. Yeah, that's but it. But we'll have a video of that coming up. But we're going to throw in a video, a short clip of the car, right? That's right. And then we're going to do like a music thing following that of the car before and after of pretty much close to the same angles yes so you can get an idea um, but what's the main thing of this whole ordeal that everybody made made it out safely that's, nobody got hurt that's right because Shaber wasn't with you was he no he wasn't uh, I had to work and she went to pick up her youngest daughter who was in the back seat where the fire started that's right yep it was just me and the two girls. Yeah, so it started right beside her. Yes, it did. So, but it's a good thing, you know, you guys got stopped and got out okay, huh? We got stopped, we got out okay. We were treated very decently by the police that responded. And um, he took us to afterwards, because we were two and a half hours away from home. And he took us to Bob Evans and bought us dinner to uh, while we were waiting for our ride to get there. And um, we also had a waitress that came over and gave us some money. She said, you guys probably will need this and uh, everything. So I want to give a holler out to the waitress at Bob Evans and the police that responded. Zanesville, Every Zanesville Police Department, Zanesville, Ohio. Yeah. I don't want to say his name because I don't have permission, but... Yeah, but, um, you know, everybody... Special thanks, yeah, to Yeah, him. everybody always quick to judge badly, but, you know, they never say thank you when it's when they do something right. And they did treat us awful nice. Yeah, this officer was, was very kind-hearted and was really understanding. And he was, what, a half a mile away when he got the call and seen the car burning? Yeah. A half a mile away, he seen the flames and the smoke. Yeah, he did. But we got a, I got a short clip of where it happened at, and so me and Pooh Bear pulled off right alongside the road so I can get that clip for you. Yeah. But the Pooh car is no more. No. So anyway, we think it was electrical, being that uh, them Buick LeSabers have the battery and the main distribution box, which is the main fuse box underneath the seat, and when you saw the flames... That's where it started. Yeah. So they was going down the road when they turned around and seen the flames coming out from underneath the back seat. So I'm thinking it's electrical. You can definitely tell by looking at the pictures and at the video that that is the origin of where it started. So I'm not liking that too well. No. <laughs> but everybody's fine. We still had a great Christmas. Yes, we did. And so anyway, that's going to be that. So... Take a look at this and we'll be right back with you here in just a minute, YouTube. Wow.
Man, that thing had headrest monitors, <laughs> DVD player, backup cameras gone. <laughs> There's what's left of the backup cam. Dad, I found the rest of your fishing pole in the trunk. <clears throat> I don't think it's any good anymore. Alright, well. I'm sorry. Get a picture of this fuse block again, and we'll go. What's left of the Buick? This is where the car burn up at. Right here. As you can see, it's very busy. So, I'm gonna have to get off of here. And we'll get back with you. Hi, YouTube. There's where the car burn up. I better get back in here. As you can see, it's very, very busy here. So, I'll be back. So, there you have it. So, we, you know, just want to extend our gratitude to all those that have helped us and kept uh, my girl safe when I couldn't be there. So, and we appreciate it. And we hope everyone had a Merry Christmas and we hope everyone has a Happy New Year. Yes. So, we'll upload some photos of the HHR <laughs> <laughs> which is weird because it's a panel considered like a panel van on one side but the other side has regular doors really weird looking yeah something just out of this world different <clears throat> of course yeah like me <laughs> <laughs> say it <that> again <laughs> like me all right all right well then we're gonna let you go thanks for watching and thanks for all your support yes thanks a lot everybody be safe. Pooh Bear out. All right. Shea Bear, I'm gone. Bye, guys.